Prince William and Kate Middleton don't use PDAs like Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Body language experts point out how William and Kate display romantic micro-gestures in public. In an interview, body language expert Judy James gives insight into how William and Kate approach the red carpet compared to Harry and Meghan. Hello and welcome to Royal Insider. If you're here for the first time, be sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss all our royal updates. James looked at each couple's recent looks and body language at events. Harry and Meghan attended the Ripples of Hope ceremony in New York, while William and Kate attended the Earthquake Awards in Boston in December. For William and Kate, Harry and Meghan, red carpet appearances are different in the world, James explained. However, there are some obvious similarities, especially between the brothers, who still tend to mirror each other's subconscious states of repression and confusion. James noticed that both brothers were uncomfortable on the red carpet. None of these men posed on the red carpet, which is often a rite of passage for celebrities to put something in their DNA or for self-promotion, explained the expert. They are all seen as a necessary evil to pose for the camera, which they usually do before family holidays as a trade-off for privacy. Royals don't usually need publicity, they tend to avoid it. She added, this history is reflected in both men's self-soothing gestures of partial disability, with William placing his hand on his stomach and Harry fiddling with his clothes. However, Harry is now a celebrity with a marketable product, and his camera-friendly smile is bigger than William's slightly shy one. James elaborates on how Harry and Meghan have been more open about their public display of love. William and Kate also lack the relationship narrative that Harry and Meghan use in their body language cues, James explained. Harry and Meghan show and describe their enduring love story to fans, making their hand-holding and Meghan's flattering, obsessive gaze important, she noted. Kate and William tended to go for a more subtle touch and look, more about the Thai logo, the little twists and romantic micro-gestures, rather than being different, explains James.